guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a braces experience. I've had my braces for about two months now. People say my teeth look pretty straight, but uh, they're getting there. So yeah, before I blab on too much, let's just hop right into the video. Okay, so the first thing is I've had my braces for about two months. And if you can can't see let's see. I had to come film with me. But, yeah. I've had it for about two months. I go, I'm not gonna really tell you where I go because it's confidential. Um, but, people I go to are very nice and they take care of my teeth very well. I also, if you guys didn't know, I haven't really featured this in any of my videos. I have headgear too. So it just goes like, the metal stops here, and there's just like, it's like a headband that goes like that. So it's actually not that bad. Um, you really have to get used to it. Like, those of you who have are going to get headgear and have never had it before, it is not that bad. People say it makes you look like a nerd and everything, but for me, all I wear is at night. And who's going to see you at night? Nobody. Okay? So if you... Are getting like so worked up, like, oh my god, people are gonna make fun of me. I'm not gonna have any friends. Don't worry, nobody's gonna see you in your headgear. Um, the first few nights of headgear it is really uncomfortable for like a sleeper like me who I sleep on my side of my head, not like regular people who like sleep in the back or I don't know how you sleep or anything. I sleep on my sides and it sticks out, so it's hard to sleep on your side. Maybe we should get some light in here, but. It's hard to sleep on your side. So, what I'd suggest is if you have like a stuffed animal or something, which I do, and I have a dog, and I put the two like paws like right in between the headgear part, and you know what that does? It makes it so it's elevating your head, and then you can just sleep on your side. So that's what I do. So there's just a little life hack for headgear. Um, the braces excel. If you have headgear, I can't really give you advice if you don't really have high gear with it. Because high gear with it, people say the first day doesn't hurt at all. When you have high gear, you had to like, see, I made it go to school, but I didn't have to wear it. But the first day it hurts because they have to adjust the high gear. And they literally pull on your teeth. It hurts so bad. People say that braces hurt. But for me, it was head gear that hurt. So that night I had to wear it. And that morning... I had taken like two. What do you think you're doing when the door's closed? It hurt. I had to take like two ibuprofen, so I'd recommend ibuprofen for the morning. Oh, it is. Goodness. For the morning of your first day of headgear. Okay? And luckily me, I had to go to school the first morning of high gear. That sucked. So, I'll be right back once I let him out of my room. All right, I'm back. So, another thing I recommend is watching a lot of Netflix, YouTube, whatever you really like to do, because it's gonna help a lot. Like, it takes your mind off of how much your mouth hurts. Focuses more on something more entertaining. I also recommend doing a YouTube channel like I am um, because it's fun making YouTube videos and it gets your mind off of it like right away. Um, well, oh, I'm sorry. I When I gone, I practically cried. So yeah. But since I'm not really focusing on you guys. Um, but what I also recommend is having a lot of ice cream and smoothies but for me smoothies um stung my lips i also recommend using the wax but then you get used to it so you don't really need to use it but i actually recommend using the wax any place you need it because the wax honey wax helps p i don't use it anymore i'm pretty sure i lost it or it's in my lunch bag i think it's in my lunch bag and that thing that they gave you to you know Put up your teeth before, if you get food stuck in it, just go like, like, 
suck in all your saliva like you would like swallow, but you go like you know you suck all that in. Pulls the food right out. You don't even need to use that. Actually, through my legs, my night really disgusting because I try to do <laughs> use it right after I eat an Oreo. So <laughs> yeah. Um. What else? Life hacks. Oh. If you have headgear, they recommend not washing it before you go to bed. Like, it's going to stink up the headgear or something. Wash your hair before you go to bed. Because it does not do that, but you get headgear head. <laughs> so, it's like hair goes, and then it gets really knotty. So, if you have to, shower before you go to bed. Don't shower in the morning. Like, I'm going to say, I'm going to put it off in the morning. No. Just do it that mm, You see my face? Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> okay. Just do it that night before. It's like a lifesaver and it saves time. What else? I think that's anything else. I think that's all. So, yeah. Alright, guys. Thank you guys so, so much for watching my video. And, yeah. If you really like my... If you want me to do a video with my dog that kind of like doesn't like to be on camera a lot, I'll try. But if you want me to have a video with my dog, I would like to get this video to five likes. If I get five likes, I'll do a video with Otis. And yeah. So make sure to like this video if you want to do see that. And subscribe if you're not already in my little world because I'm doing Veda. And I'm going to be posting a video every day of August. And then you get to get to see some of this a little more. Okay, so yeah, see you guys next time.